Um, this thing on? Oh yeah, I think it is. Okay. Uh, uh I just beat the final boss. I probably should have done that on stream. I don't know, but uh, figured it might be fun to. Sorry about the wait. In any case, am I clear? Be on guard. <laughs> Come back anytime. I've been waiting for ya. Sleep tight. Here's the guest okay. book, dear. I'm gonna try to wait uh, to actually turn in my quest, just because I'm not getting Don't any XP forget, at level cap like this. For ya. And from what I heard, beating this boss will actually give me the um, give me the some level cap that I want. So try to do that real quick. I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna get destroyed though, but it might be funny. Everybody's fully. Okay. Oh, this thing. Why did I hit the pen? Oh my god. Oh, that wasted it. That sucks. I think what you're supposed to do is kill it in one turn, and I ruined it. Ah, uh, that's lame. And I can't run, either. That is super lame. Let's see how much this would have done. Not quite enough anyway, I guess. That sucks. I really wanted to get... Uh, this is on expert too, so being able to kill that in one turn without switching to picnic mode would have been cool. I've been of course sleep tight. Here's the guest book, dear. So now we can go back. Don't forget, I'm cheering for ya! I've already mapped out this area before.
to get out of that. Is it on the ninth floor? Oh, it is on the ninth floor. But yeah, I've already been. What? Now I'm really confused. Glad to see you. Hmm? Oh, it's you. <laughs> May you find fortune on your travels. Come back anytime. Take your time. Talk as much as you want. Oh, it's you. Talk as much as you want. <laughs> Talk as much as you want. Lock him once for me, huh? In any case. 
Buttons. Come back anytime. Take your time. Not bad. What's the matter? Huh? <laughs> Sorry, all cleared out. <laughs> Clock them once for me, huh? Oh, whatever. I guess we'll try out the new area. <laughs> I need to, uh, I, I need to respect my characters actually while we're still at level cap, because, uh, what do you call it? This? This is bad. I, I set this up for the final boss, but, like, not having anything here is very, uh, not useful. And also, life trade didn't turn out to be all that good. <laughs> so. Oh, holy shit. At least they let me out. Oh, of course! I'll take those! Oh, we have some new things come in! 
Ah, could I help you with anything else? Here you go! Thank you for choosing us! Glad to see you. Rest as much as you need to. Was there something else? I guess the rest of that I'll figure out later. <laughs> Take your time. Oh wait, can what I... you just got here? I don't actually know if that if that's how it works, but glad to see you. Uh, oops. What will you do? Consider this carefully. Done. Never go alone. Come back. Get all the time. XP. Nobody else is getting. Take your time. Anymore. What do you got for me? Not bad. How's it going? Give me a break. <laughs> oh, that wasn't worth it. Right. Nice. Which is this one, huh? Whoops. <laughs> well, I'm counting on you. <laughs> Glock him once for me, huh? Glad to see you. What will you do? Consider this carefully. Done. Come back anytime. I've been waiting for ya! Sleep tight! Here's the guest book, dear. Don't forget, I'm cheering for ya! As the star decrees, I welcome our visitors, blessed with light. Hmm. Indeed. What? What did you say? I see. Farewell.
indeed. Praise unto the star. I'm gonna quit my... I forgot it does that when you use that. You appear well, Earthbound Ones. You are wondrous indeed. Welcome back, everyone! I'll take good care of them. Thank you for choosing us. Take your time. What do you got for me? Not bad. Sure. You gotta be. Here it is. This one, huh? Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> Clock him once for me, huh? I've been waiting for you. Sleep tight. Here's the guest book, dear. Don't forget, I'm cheering for you. Is that so? Indeed. Do you understand? Shall meet again. Where, where is it? Up above? <laughs> Maybe it was assuming I'd I'd have been yet, I guess.
Is that the whole floor? Oops. I'm bad at mapping on this thing. I'm supposed to get through here then. There's no uh Jesus.
show feet? Oh no, I don't have, uh, there's no feet in this game. Uh, if you want, you can, like, uh, what do you, what do you call it? You can look at, like, the character's feet. Hang on. I think she might have some feet. Uh, never mind. They all have shoes on. There's no feet, sorry. If you needed feet for, uh, your gaming. Take your time. All right. Which one you think? This one, huh? <laughs> Clock him once for me, huh? I've been waiting for ya. Sleep tight. Here's the guest book, dear. Don't forget, I'm cheering for ya. Go left? I went left. I don't think there's any other... Any other way but forward, sorry. Yeah, this game is kind of like the hit game Labyrinth of Refrain, but that game is is newer than this. This game is older than that game. So actually, uh, you you could say that the hit game Labyrinth of Refrain looks like the hit game Etrian Odyssey 2 Untold. How about that? You think that this game copied the hit game Labyrinth of Refrain? I mean, you might be right, I don't know. I, I I don't work for either of them, so I don't know who stole from who. Oh. SF5? Why would I stream SF5? There's no content. No one's gonna no one's gonna watch that. I mean not like anybody's gonna watch this. <laughs> but hey. This is a game I just beat. I'm I'm an expert. The Awakening stream? Maybe I could do one of the other Fire Emblems. I got a... Uh, I've already beaten Awakening a ton of times, so it wouldn't be that interesting, like, for me. But, uh, I could maybe do, um... Shadows of Valentia or, like, Fates. I have both of those on here. I've never... Well, I, I did play a pretty good amount of, uh... Of Echoes, Shadows of Valentia, but, like, I, I didn't finish it. Uh, and then Fates, I've never played it, so... Might be kind of fun to do that, I don't know. Oh, he's got that weak, never mind. I just get bored? What the fuck? 
VTuber collab plans? Um, not, not, uh, not especially. I don't know. I don't, I don't really know too many V. Well, actually, that's not true. I know a few, but I don't know any that would want to uh, collab with me because I'm not a VTuber. I'm a, I'm a blob. Uh, man, if you if you saw my my VTuber uh, model that I made trying to look like a puny, I think you'd probably like instantly die. It's it looks really cursed, but it, it's really funny though. I made like a bald dude with like the gradient blue to green uh, skin, and and he has like a funny looking face because I couldn't make like the long eyes, so I had to like kind of fuck up his. You know his his uh, eye structure. I had to like collapse his eyes in on themselves and then delete his nose and try to twist his lips into this uh, like depressing little. I I'll have to show you sometime. It looks really funny though. Can I make it through? Oh yeah, I can. Okay. Is it, this is supposed to be the shortcut over. Here. Uh, I don't have the the program up at the moment. I could try it though if you guys really want to see it. Uh, it might take me a little bit to, to set it up. When I did her stupid uh, respect, for coming. <laughs> it unequipped all of her gear. Because I always forget it does that. Uh, Doing this then? You want to equip? He needs. Can you get a twist? No, you can't get one. I'm sorry. There's no no twist here. guys I've been waiting of course sleep tight here's the guest book dear okay how do I I put this down set it down right here um and then the program for that was I don't know if I still have it where is it Take take this thing out and then plug in uh, the funny thingy webcam. And once that's in, you gotta um, point point it at yourself. And then there was a you see face, I think.
Yeah, you're gonna love this one. If it ever loads. I don't think it's gonna load. <laughs> oh no. Oh, here it is. Okay, it's coming up. What's this? Are you kids just lazing around? No. Do you wanna help me run some errands? No. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Let's start. Hey, check him out. Check him out, he's right there. That's me. That's uh, my VTuber. I'm a VTuber. Check it out. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I told you, I, I could be a VTuber, but I, I don't know if anybody would want to work with me. You, you know what I'm- you, know, you get what I'm saying? Like, you feel me? Now... I think I just have to do, like, crop... Uh, crop 200 thousand pixels or something 400 to the left 400 to the right and then to the top uh 400 oh shit took my head off uh 200 no the center 150 and then off the bottom i just i have to cut off like the shirt so i would do like 400 oh are you oh, children shit. taking a uh, rest 200 should i bring you and your yeah. friends some cookies 250 Shit. 300. Oh yeah, there I am. Now that's my VTuber model. Now if you, if you're comfortable being a VTuber with me, what we can do, we can be a VTuber uh, together. And you could put me like on your screen like this. I could be a streamer and like, I don't know if it, I don't think it's detecting my camera. Like normally it's supposed to look around when I look around, but I guess it's just moving with my, uh, with my, like my mic. What do you think? I think I got a bright future in uh, in the VTuber community. I think they would love me here. Shit. You're dying in four... <laughs> no, don't die. Come on. I, I worked really hard on this. Fuck you. I'm, I, I worked so hard on this. You don't even know. I was like... Sleepless nights up thinking about how to become a VTuber. Uh, I don't know where I'll fit on the, the thing. I don't know where's a where's a good spot to be a VTuber. Like on your like right here. Right here. And then like move this back over. Oh, are you children taking a rest? Should I bring you and your friends some cookies? I, I think that works. And then I could just, uh... We do, like, uh, remove this one. And... This one right like behind me, I guess. I don't know. Do it like that. There you go. So now I'm a, now I'm a VTuber. What do you think? Tell me it's not the best layout you've ever seen. I mean, actually, don't don't tell don't me it's not forget, the best layout I'm you've ever seen. For ya. <laughs> <laughs> He's staring into your soul. I love this. Wait, maybe if I flip it upside down, though, it'd look a little bit more like a pony. Like if I, hang on, if I like flipped it and then like cut the neck off. You know what I'm saying? Like, let's do flip vertical. Up like that. See, now that looks more like a puny right there. That's like... <laughs> that's a puny... 
puny shape. You know what I mean? I should maybe I should undo that though. And that there we go. Yeah. What was I doing? I forgot. I quit. This this game. Uh, I've been waiting for ya. Here's the guest. I don't think I was uh, built. I don't think I was built to play this right now. When's the first album? Wait, what album? What am I? Uh, what am I making a song? You guys want? Oh, do you guys want to hear my song? I don't know if I still got the file for my song, but you remember I, I made one before. I think I'm pretty talented. Um, I have like the skill of a um. What was it? I think uh, what's that thing that Shiro says? He's like, I got. She has the skill of an educated prostitute or something like that. Like that's my music. Um, let me get this here. I don't know if I still have the file to it. It might be inside of my RPG Maker folder. Yeah, see, so you you get what I mean. Like it's a pretty good metaphor, uh, honestly. There's like a theme, screenshots, F. Library apps common. Um, uh, did I have RPG Maker on it? I thought I did, or maybe it was uh maybe it's in my other library. E. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, RPG Maker M. Uh. Bear with me here. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna have this song on for you guys in just a little bit. I'll probably make it my alert music too. To really uh really show my chops live on Twitch. Projects. Project one audio PG. Something terrible. In oh fuck that's loud okay okay uh and I uh do you think that that OBS can play uh can play OGG files I've never tried it but this would this would be the one in library common RPG Maker projects, project audio, BGM, something terrible. Oh yeah. Oh, I hear it now. <laughs> yeah, I I wrote that. What'd you think? What'd you think? Give me give me like a grade. <laughs> Why are you crying? It's it's good though. Alright, I'll try to make something better later. I'll, I'll come up with a... Don't worry, I, I'll make a better song. But I mean, that one... That one... Was like my best attempt, so I put it in my RPG Maker game. Um, about a monkey... Do you guys want to see my RPG Maker game? I could play that. I'm gonna, uh... I'm gonna check it out, it's pretty cool. Uh, it's got like... Um... Wait, how do I put it on here? RPG Maker MV. Alex? Oh, you want me to put Alex in the game? I mean, I guess I could do that. So if I do um, test, I think it was. Uh, play test. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna play test my game real quick. Uh, let me just add it onto here, dude. My bitrate is gonna be so fucked. Like, 
trying to keep all these different uh, things open at once. Can you guys hear it, by the way? Also, where is it? I can't see my game. Why is it not displaying? Okay, maybe I gotta do like a window capture. Let me try that real quick. Oh, there we go. All right, so this is my game, uh, Herald the First Light. Uh, hang on, bear with me. I gotta get this music on as well. Uh, Yeah, I'm I'm about to put it on there. It's it's a double-edged sword, right? So this nice little thing about uh my whoops about this plugin I got, you can specify what program you want to be audible, but at the same time it does make it a little bit difficult because of the uh That should Is that on now? It makes it a little bit difficult because I had to set this up every time I turn it on, so this is my game, Herald the First Light. I can make it a little bit bigger, I think. Um, and pretty much what I was going for with this one is like a is like a classic RPG experience. You guys might have played uh, Final Fantasy before, so I thought about it and I was like, I like the crystal storyline that they have in Final Fantasy. So I made a game where you play as a crystal. Um, and here's the party. Yeah, there's Herald, the crystal bearer, but he's he's like a crystal. And then there's Reimu from Toho and Rance from, um, what's that thing where it, Go Animate? It's Rance from Go Animate, and they're all together here in a party. Uh, and this is the first enemy in the game, his name's Imposter, and what I was going for here is like, Among Us was really popular at the time, so I wanted to make like kind of a discreet reference to that series. So the imposter is silenced, and now he can't use his Among Us sus attack. He, I think normally he can vent, uh, but when he's silenced, he can't use that technique. This one, it takes a little bit to... Yeah, Harold six crystals, but what I was going for is, like, animating him, right? And animation's a little bit difficult, but I'm gonna figure it out. So what I did was I put him in, but I think when I put the animation in there, it showed him as six crystals, but it doesn't always move. It only moves at certain times of the day. Now the other problem with this fight is that I, I think I gave him a little bit too much HP. But we'll, we'll get that, you know, that get that uh, ironed out by the time the real game comes out. Holy shit, he's still alive! <laughs> Oh my goodness. Who, who, who just at me? What happened? <laughs> oh, you took a screenshot? Oh no! <laughs> oh, there we go. We finally killed the imposter. Alright, so we got the drippy. Um, and the way I balance this game is that when you, once you kill Among Us Drip, you actually can get some Drippy and equip this to... Wait, I... shit, who can use it? I don't remember. Uh -oh. Did I mess this up? I might have messed this up, but... There's a shop? Uh, not that door. That door doesn't work. This one. Um, so you can get Drippy and... Wait. 
I think, yeah, he can use it. Why can't he equip it? That's weird. But yeah, I can sell it uh, if I wanted to. And I, you could sell Drippy to get 10 Drip. And then once you've sold that, um, you can use that to... Oh, see, and <laughs> I forgot I did that. If you couldn't purchase something, he, uh, he beats your ass. So you get into a fight with a uh, rat from uh, Grand Blue Fantasy. I know how much people like Grand Blue Fantasy. Really popular game lately. Yeah, I do need to give Harold some more techniques. A at this time, he can't really do anything with the TP. So, like, Crystal Chuck generates a lot of TP for him, but he doesn't really get anything out of it, so... That's one of the things that I needed to rebalance, make him a little bit more, uh, useful there. But, we killed the horse, the shopkeeper's been killed, now we can buy stuff from him with Drip. And now we can purchase the Drippy. What, what the fuck? Oh! Okay, well that doesn't work correctly. That's actually supposed to, like, he's supposed to be defeated. If, if you bought something. Like, but this is strong though, it kills everybody. Just like in the real Rance game, uh, Rance attack is really strong. Yeah, our rat. Uh, okay, so that's done. I think I made a room up here in the bar. Uh, so you, as you can see, there's a tavern here um, in my game. I think I also added... One of these is you can go inside of them, I think. Oh yeah, this one. Yeah. How you feeling about this one? Kind of, kind of, kind of cool, right? Um, and then up here, I was testing out like a roguelike kind of game where you could actually just run into the enemies and fight them. I've played a few RPG Maker games that know how to do it, but I couldn't figure it out. So he's just kind of there. He can hurt you, like he does damage, but I, I can't fight back. I don't know how to do it. So. Uh, later on, I'll have to figure that out sometime. Um, I think I also... Somewhere up here, I think you can go inside of? Oh no, okay, never mind. My memory is not the best on, on my game, it's been a while since I last uh, worked on it. Yeah, this is the, the heal crystal. Blessed be, you stupid bitch. Now we're fixed up. Um... I think you could save, yeah, you could save anywhere um, in my game. There's also, I made this little dungeon, so you can walk in here and... He took over the place, but we have to kill him because it's not his house. So he's dead. And the way I was supposed to do it is that he dies, and you saw that animation, right? That was a really complicated animation. Um, I took him out, he got gunned down by a bear in the big blue house, uh, and then he's supposed to be gone forever because I, I took him out for questline, but he respawns for some reason, <laughs> so I need to fix that. Um, but it, it mostly functions correctly, the animation's there, and honestly I thought it was pretty cool. Um, let's see, I also added an overworld, um, when you're out in the world you can go to a few different locations. I made a, a world map that's comparable in size to Final Fantasy 2. Um, there's also some like alien activity here, uh, like crop circles. Now, nobody really knows in, in this world, like so in the context of this world, nobody knows what the, what the aliens were trying to say <laughs> when they were... <laughs> when they <laughs> when <laughs> when they were uh, coming down to earth um there's also these guys uh so there's a the way the overworld i've tried to design it like smt3 nocturne uh you can stand over locations and then go into them um and it does like this little scroll it's like this is dungeon and then you find out that you're going into the dungeon and the quicker you scroll it it lets you in uh, so this is where I have my battles and I was I was experimenting with maybe like no random encounters so this would be uh, this would be you have to actually touch them to get into a fight we get in a fight with this guy and there's a bat and I got a little I got a drop table set up uh, what is game oh this uh so this was uh, they asked me to show my RPG maker game um not the greatest. I'm, I'm an amateur, uh, but 
I wanted to show off some of the some of the features I put in. I was playing Etrian Odyssey 2 Untold. Uh, I beat that game a little while ago. Um, but yeah, this was the the map that there's like a little thing you can do in there. Her <laughs> <laughs> Herald the Untold Fafnir Knight, yeah. Um, there's like a what's the word? There there's a two, yeah, two. Um, there's a random dungeon maker, and it like creates the tile set for you if you're if you're like not creative for it. Um, and then that's yeah, that's my exit. It puts you out here. That's that's pretty much all I got. This this one, this boss. If you walk up and talk to him, he actually instant kills you. You just die, and you find out that he was actually the overlord. Yeah, no, I, I uh, this wasn't this wasn't programming. This is RPG maker. <laughs> Don't worry. Don't uh, don't need to worry about my skills on on this one. It wasn't very good, but I, I'm thanks for saying so though. Oh, um, so let me close these out. Uh, but yeah, now I don't know what now I I don't know what to do. I kind of just filled the screen with a bunch of stuff. I don't uh, you guys have like a game you wanted to play or something? <laughs> I don't know what what will be uh. SF5? Oh god. Okay. I mean, I can do SF5, <clears throat> but if I play it, it would have to be, um, I would need to play it on, I, I don't have it installed on the Steam Deck, so I'd have to play it on the PC, but I can do that. Let me disable this. Oh, even RPG Maker? I mean, RPG Maker's kind of tricky. I guess it, uh, well, <laughs> no, I should say it is tricky, because it, as you saw with that game, that was not that was not a good game so i should be i should be fair it's actually pretty tough uh let's get this down unplug this play fire emblem heroes uh i don't think i can i'm pretty sure fe heroes has like a a thing blocking you from doing emulators or not emulators uh or yeah, I think blue blue stacks like emulating Android. I don't think that's allowed. I might be wrong though, for it. But I guess I could try and get. Oh no! Why did I close that? Oh shoot! My bad. I'm I'm I got deleted. <laughs> Genshin Impreg. Oh no! I mean, uh, I guess I could, but I don't think anybody wants to see me play Genshin of all things. Uh, Genshin Impreg, yeah. Oh no. Don't worry, I'll be right back. <laughs> there I am. Okay, I've returned. Uh, wait, so am I actually playing SF5 or am I, or am I playing uh, something else? Wait, which one am I playing? Something else. Oh, okay. I was gonna plug in my controller. Labyrinth of Refrain. Refrain. Um. Oh no, I crashed it. My face is gone. <laughs> uh. Yeah. I. I mostly gave up on it too. Um. Making an RPG was something I was really interested in when I was like a kid. Uh. I used to play around with like the older RPG makers, but th that one I got it when it was on a real cheap sale. Um. To kind of make up for the fact that I didn't pay for them before. But I, I just, I don't think I got, like, the right creativity for that to actually, um, you know, make make an RPG Maker game and stuff and actually see it all the way through and make a true, true game. Bravely Default? Uh, I do, actually, yeah. Did you want me to play that? I don't know if my... I don't remember if I transferred my save for it. I know I transferred my save for the other 3DS games, but uh, I'm not sure if that one made it in. Bravely Default actually wouldn't be a bad idea because it it would uh good fast forward game crank it up crank what up crank my song you want to hear it oh crank the game okay <laughs> my bad my bad let me let me go get it um 
There's... I'll have it on in just a moment. I need to get everything turned back on. Look at this. Being, being at everybody's whims is so difficult. Where was it at on there? Non Steam, Bravely Default. Okay, I thought I had it on here. Hmm. Maybe I did the, uh. Nintendo 3DS? What? Do I really not have it? Wow, I could have swore I put it on here. I did not, I guess. Wow, that sucks. Why did I not put that on? I have the game, I don't know why it wouldn't be put on here. Well, I guess I don't have Bravely Default, sorry about that. You're, you're out of luck, buddy. I guess I, uh, I will, I will be right back. I'm gonna use the restroom. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh, so you, you're actually having it with, like, a whole story and everything? Yeah, it's, it can be tough to, uh, to actually get a, a whole story going in a game as well. Like, in all of mine, they were always just kind of goofy. Uh, yeah, just a moment. Shoot. Okay. Yeah, I don't. I don't know uh, what to. What to play now? I guess I could put on Dragon Guard. I don't know if you guys would want to see that. <laughs> Okay, well, we got a Drakengard fan in the chat. Looks like you're the winner. Unbelievable. Oh, did I never put it in my... I guess I didn't put it in my favorites, huh? Uh, Fire Emblem's like a strategy RPG series. It's like, uh, you know, knights and magic and stuff, but uh, when they... When they fight, they're like on these grids, and you control a, a big army and have them go and like take out other guys. It's a... Uh, Usually pretty simple, but I guess like the difficulty usually comes in with the weapons having durability, so they only have a certain number of uses, Square and then, Enix. uh, what do you call it? The... Was this it? I thought this was in widescreen before. Did I change something? 
Child units. Child. Oh well, child units is a new thing. Uh, not the. Well, I guess the some of the older games had it. Fire Emblem Four had it as well. Sorry guys, just a moment. I forgot. I, I think I actually did change something because my friend was trying to have me do. Um, he's trying to have me do the. Oops. What did I do a wide screen on? I think so. Oh, now I really am confused. I don't know. Oh, I guess it's no big deal then. <clears throat> I mean, technically the game is supposed to be uh, in 4.3 anyway, but I, I thought it was a widescreen thing last time I played it. I don't know. Uh, yeah, they usually the difficulty comes from like accuracy being a thing. Enemies can crit you and stuff gets kind of dangerous. Uh, whoops, that's... which one is fast forward? I don't remember all my hotkeys. Oh, there it is. Okay. Square Enix. Square. Oh, so he's, he's too, uh, he would just kill everything if it was a game. <laughs> that sounds like our main character in Drakengard here. Time is a little bit too powerful, so they, they had to make this game really hard to, to compensate. Also, I can't see anything, oh my god. Did I even, um... Oh, okay, he is my only follower guy. Never mind. More weapons to equip. Why, why is this game, like, lagging now? This is so weird. <laughs> Oh, it's because fast forward is on, that's why. Okay. The voice has become more unstable. If we do not hurry. <laughs> How do you get off the dragon again? Select? Oh, here we go. Oh wait, I need to switch weapons, right? Uh, shoot. Oh, not this one. What was his, uh... R2? R2. Yeah, yeah cause I, I need to power this thing up so I can actually fight the, uh... the stronger guys. That voice! From whence does it come? This is some riveting game. Why is it not hitting him? Oh my god. <laughs> Please. Oh no.
I saw it. Oh, we got him. Okay. Light? What is this voice trying to tell us? I still can't see my health. To me, I, I hope you're happy making me play this. <laughs> hope oh, I hope you understand what you've done. God soothe your heart. In these times, faith is all we have. Uh, okay. Where do I go next? God, it keeps locking onto the wrong guy. Oh, so he's, it's just like a story about a game character anyway, then? Oh, God. Come on. These archers are the worst. And I'm keep taking damage. Man, I hope I'm not about to die. I can't even see what my hope is at. Oh, there we go. Okay, give me that.
combo is insane. Okay, we got him. Oh, right, I should update the, the game that it's showing. I just realized. Let me change that. Draken Guard 1. I think I can call it Draken Guard. We'll call it, we'll title this Draken Guard is the greatest game ever made. Draken. Okay, perfect. Oh, thanks for the follow. Uh, Arable, please. Appreciate it. Humans cannot see that blood and idols get each other. I don't, uh, I don't stream, like, super frequently, but, uh, every, every once in a while I'll get on and usually play something goofy, so thanks for, thanks for that. And yeah, thanks for the uh, the tip about the healing, Keandre. That that actually, I think that might help me beat this level finally. <laughs> Every time I get like a 17 hit combo, I just get a heal out of it, and that's pretty useful. It's gonna take a long time though because this weapon is so wimpy. Come on, no, 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 no. Don't get away, don't get away, don't get away. Don't. Oh my god, I died. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Why is it so laggy right now? Oh yeah, uh, I, it's like a, a Greek name, right? I'm not sure if I've seen it like specifically like that, but the kind of like the parts to to spell it, I, I've seen those. I'm familiar with it a little bit. Um, why is it why is it lagging so hard? I don't know what's up with that. It last time it ran super well. I wonder if it's. If I do default. Maybe that'll fix it. Huh. I still got it like that. Square Enix. 
Wait, I don't know why I turned this back on. I'm not playing this again. <laughs> oh, gotcha, gotcha. Oh. Is the right one? I think this is a different... Get on Dokapon Kingdom. Listen, I if you want, I guess. <laughs> Yeah, it, I, I've seen um, a few names that are similar to that in some games I've played, so I, I guess I just figured it's kind of like that. Oh, maybe that's why. Was it running it off of this? Maybe that's why it did. Hmm. Maybe it's just because of the new. Oh, so. All right, I need to <laughs> switch that real quick just so I can see. Let's switch it back. Yeah, just to see, cause I I don't know why it's so uh so laggy you now. Unless it's like the settings, cause I I updated the thing uh the emu deck thing that I was using to get all the emulators set up, and I think that might have given me a new ECSX two and like makes it lag or something. You said play Dokapon Kingdom. <laughs> Wait, where is it? Oh, this one. Sure, why not? Let's see how that does it. Oh, this is a Sting game? I was just playing uh, uh, Baroque earlier today. Baroque is, is also a Sting game. As is uh, Yggdra Union, but don't tell, uh, don't tell Ken. playing this <laughs> should I play against three CPUs I don't I don't know what this is it's a board game right board game RPG choose a name Now. And here it is. 
Is it like one of those, uh... What do you call it? Is it one of those stories where, like, you're playing as the people who used to be his friends, and then you have to go take them down? I think romancing Saga. What? One or two or something like that was like that? You had to go kill the, the old heroes because they turned into villains? Or... Okay, I see, I see. Um... <laughs> Are you guys sure you want me to be playing a board game? I don't know if this is uh, so good without actual players. You're the one who told me to start this up, though. <laughs> uh... Oh, can I choose how far I want to go? I don't, I don't even know how this works. <laughs> oh god. Wait, that wasn't you. Oh, that was Timmy that said that. I'm sorry. <laughs> maybe, uh, maybe this, maybe Timmy's just trying to make me play all the worst stuff. Is this even fun? Not so good. I mean, you did want me to play uh, Dragon Guard, so I don't know. Oh, you have to stop on the one that it wants you to. Okay. Um. I'm coming. Yeah, I don't. I don't know if I should. Uh, I should still play this. One. <laughs> I might be better off playing SF5, but uh, Doka 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 Pun Kingdom. Doka Pun Kingdom. Did I hit like the random random game button? I think that's a thing. Well, wasn't that some? Yeah, I guess that was something, huh? <laughs> that w that was a game, I think. Possibly. Oh wait, I think it. No, oh, no, that's not the remake one. That's the old Tsukihime. I forgot. I, I should put the remake on here. Thank you. 
Let me, let me know if there's anything silly you want me to you want me to die in or something. Oh, I guess I could try to play it. Oh, girls, I don't know. Might not be a good idea. Actually, hang on. I found you. <laughs> you, guys, you guys are trying to pull the strings behind the scenes, make me play bad games. I see how it is. <laughs> mm, yeah, that's true. I probably shouldn't have done that. Pokemon's not a good idea. You, 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 uh, you got any request? Any... I don't. I do. I don't. Listen, I, I might. I might have a few, but you can't. You can't stop me. Yeah, Dragon Guard is like the most fun game I've ever played. Do you like uh, Eternal Ring? This is a uh, Eternal Ring. No, this is this is Eternal Ring. No, I, I don't have Shadow of Colossus on this. Uncharted Blades? Wait, I think I've heard of that game. Is uh Uncharted Blades. Oh un Unchained Blades? Oh Unchained. Yeah, you know, I played that back on uh PSP, actually. Uh I don't think I currently have it on here though. This game is uh is by FromSoft. You might know them for Dark Soul. But they, they made a Kingsfield as well, and this is just their PS2 Kingsfield game. Looks like I got a whole party on the bottom of the screen now. They're helping me out for this game. Stella Glow? Yeah, I, I tried it out a little bit. Stella Glow is pretty cool. Red door. Mm hmm. Art stream? Uh, I don't. I don't do. Uh, I could do an art stream, but I don't think anything would come out of it. Oh, also, let me turn you up. Sorry. I just noticed I could barely hear you. Yeah, the, uh, what do you call it? I have, I have a tablet, but I can't, it's not one of the ones where you can look at it. I have to, like, look up at the screen and it hurts my head because I, I don't know how to coordinate between the screen that I can't see and stuff. Use a mouse pad? Uh, yeah, it's kind of like that. I, I just didn't find it too easy to work with. Yeah, Rune Factory 4 is fun. I like that game. Have you played uh, Rune Factory 5? I, I like that one. Nice. 
not enough graphics, but you don't like old... You don't like PS2 games. Oh, you only have 3DS? Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Well, 3DS still has a lot of really fun games on it. That's why I put uh, so many onto the Steam Deck. Like, I had a lot of games that I still wanted to keep playing. Play what? Oh, have you played uh, Kid, Ic <laughs> Kid Icarus Uprising? Uh, Shin Mendor wanted to know. Wait, you can just type in the chat. You're in the chat. <laughs> oh, that's fair, yeah. <laughs> this game's like the Dragon Guard of gaming. I even fight them the same way at once. Bad beyond belief. Hey, it's not that. This isn't that bad. Uh, well, this game isn't so much like Dragon Guard, I guess. Oh, you don't have uh, mini games? Yeah. That's fine. But uh, the ones that you mentioned are pretty good. I guess Unchained Blades was on 3DS as well. I didn't know that, but. Uh, yeah, I remember that one being pretty fun. And then I know Stella Glow and Ring Factory 4 are fun. Oh. What, were, what were you guys doing? You were hiding playing, um... Playing Labyrinth or Refrain in the corner or something? <laughs> Nice. Uh oh, you weren't doing that. Oh. Go, Eternal Ring. <laughs> <laughs> it's it, hey, this is an ass. This game is cool. The controls are ass though. Um, oh, controls on 3DS are bad. That yeah, that's a shame. Um, what do you call it? Th this game has like the typical FromSoft. Uh, what do you call it? FromSoft early 2000s like control scheme. So so the controls are uh, left on the D-pad is to turn, like left and right, and then up and down on the D-pad are to move. <laughs> and uh, R1 is gonna be your strafe. L1 and R1. And then L2 and R2 are looking up and looking down. It doesn't make use of the sticks at all. <laughs> Even though it's a PS2 game. I love it. I, I think you I think you'd enjoy those controls a lot, Timmy. There's a learning curve, but. Oh, so they they really did just port it straight from PSP then. If, if they have like B as the confirm button and stuff. Yeah, but this one, this is how FromSoft made like all their ancient games, like Kingsfield and Armored Core and stuff. They all have the exact same control scheme, and it's really funny. It's super bad. But somehow they managed to make it work for like a first person point pointy stick game and for like a third person mech game. They both just work, because they both feel equally as awkward. Oh, Trevor. I think there's also a Kingsfield 4 for the PS2? I'm not sure about Kingsfield 3. I think that one is a PS1 game. Someone just added uh, Kingsfield 4 to Dustloop Wiki. <laughs> so if you need like a guide, it's on there. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, save point. Yeah, if you die in this game, it throws you straight back to the title screen. Oh, you, you do die in real life, yeah. 
Yeah, I think more games ideally should always have uh, control customizing. That's one. That's like my favorite thing with the Steam Deck, though. It's like whenever I'm playing anything, I can make anything like do whatever controls. I can change all of it to. I wanted to flip everything or invert everything or make the triggers be the bumpers or anything like that. Like, it's all doable. You can even bind stuff to be turbo if you want. But it feels weird. It makes the whole thing kind of shapey. Yeah. No, don't do that. <laughs> yeah, you, you guys are muted, that's true. I mean, I guess you can say whatever you want, but... Don't want the what? Oh, true. Twenty four twenty four hour subathon? I have like forty what forty two followers? I don't think I have enough for people to sub. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Eight, something like that. Uh <laughs> five follow bots, bro, no. Uh, I don't uh I don't think I plan on making people subscribe as far as I know. I'd say, oh, wow. Why? <laughs> Hello. Oh, right, I forgot to change the game name again. <laughs> Good point. Uh, let's call this Eternal Ring. This is the greatest game ever made. Playing a game called Eternal Ring. Category two. Eternal ring. There. How did, how's that for you? It updated, right? Baroque tag. <laughs> oh yeah, because I was playing Baroque earlier. You want to see Baroque? Baroque's pretty cool. Baroque is pretty hard. I don't. I don't know if you. I don't know if you'd like it. You? Oh, he tried to do the Dark Soul on me. Side line of the door. Only game on PC, Adventure Quest. Oh, okay. I I have a few friends that have played that. I've never played that myself, though. Yeah, tell me all about it, Timmy. I don't I don't know anything about it. Yeah, Adventure Quest. That was it. Oh, he said it's cool. <laughs> yeah, he, he said it's a cool game. I, I really I've never played it, so I don't really know. But uh, I guess he liked it. I think Robert used to play it a whole bunch, but. Uh, yeah, I don't know, I never joined him for it. Hmm? Bam? Oh, he went to Nebraska or Montana or something like that? <laughs> yeah, he... He had that sense of, uh, of justice about him for sure. Also, if you step in the water, you die instantly. Um, I'm gonna be careful not to do that. Ooh, Dark Souls moment. What's this? I found something. I opened up something. Ooh, Aqueduct. I lowered the water. I think that means in the in the other dungeon I was in earlier, the water should be lower now. And, ooh, yeah! Look at, mm. It's just like wild arms, man. I, I'm RPG Pro. What? Yeah, that's right. Actually, I should stream uh, Wild Arms 3. I like that game a lot. I never finished that either. Though. Make a list? Oh yeah, just play everything. Making a list, checking it twice. What? Serving it up Gary's way? I'm glad. <laughs> Oh! Oh, my graphics broke! Let's go! Hey, you remember until April 4th? How long does it let you, uh, member for? I don't even... Oh, 
this is where I think I can I can use the ring uh, the fire ring. Check this out. Magic button on circle. I didn't do it. Magic button on circle. <laughs> oh shit! That's almost like subscription to like the World of Warcraft and stuff like that. But I mean, if you like it enough, I don't think that's that bad. That's like a game. You know. Oops. What? What does the Ring of Magic do? Well, you can't even shoot anything with the Ring of Magic. It's a problem. <laughs> There's two crabs inside of each other. Okay, there we go. Nice! Are these doors open? I guess not. This is so disorienting with the graphics messed up. <laughs> Stop doing what? Oh shoot. Tell your cat to watch the stream. Cat plays games. Ouch. Oh my god. There we go. Get MP for killing enemies. Wait, I should be using more magic then. Oh, so it's the kind of game. I mean, I guess everybody's got games like that. They sort of just play it, kind of pass the time and everything. And I guess if you have the the membership until then, at least you don't have to uh, you probably renew it anymore. Ooh, I found some advanced tech now. <laughs> Wait, that's actually kind of cool. I can just alternate like sword, magic, sword, magic, sword, magic, and like stun lock them. Yeah, you do. Like it, it's a lot more uh, forgiving than like even the. Uh, I don't know if either of you have played Demon Souls. Like, yeah, you remember how MP regen in that game was? If you if you did happen to have the regen ring, <laughs> like it was so slow. And then otherwise you had to use grass. But in this, you're just like every time you kill something, you get a ton back. Hmm. 
Bad Zap? You talking about the rat? <laughs> the hamster? <laughs> I don't know if that's Zaza, but I guess it's close. Oh, I gotta be careful of this, uh... One wrong move, I'm gonna slip in this water and die. Oh, I found the save point. Okay, we're good. There's a door. And then there's the stairs. Well, I already saved. You guys said you wanted to see Baroque. <laughs> feeling like you're going in Baroque mode? You're feeling Baroque? Same here. Baroque is a... Baroque is a roguelike dungeon crawler by Sting. You might know them famously for games like uh, Yggdra Union. Um, Dokapon Kingdom, yep. <laughs> <laughs> They got we got two games, um, two games. It's pretty cool. I like the aesthetic of the PS One game a little bit better, uh, to be totally honest. But um, the PS Two game is maybe a little easier for people to like look at, I guess. Update the stream. Uh, I think I updated it. I just changed the name right now. I'm not sure if it updated on there. Oh, did it change? Oh, okay, cool, cool. Thank you. Uh, but yeah, this one's like. You ever played? You ever played Pokemon Mystery Dungeon or like, or Shirin or anything like that? It's like that, but in action action form. Uh, there's music. It uh, looks like this. Oh my goodness. I forgot I was poisoned right now. I, I might die, actually. I did, yeah. <laughs> um, I don't know if I have any healing things. Use the... Inject some... Get rid of my antidote. Uh... These are... These guys are little demons, and you have to purify the sinners or something. I'm gonna I'm actually gonna die. Oh god! Oh, you overate? I had a, a couple of tacos earlier. That was about it. Why is this camera not moving? There we go. Yeah, I watched a, uh, a video essay that a lady did about this game, and she was tearing it a new, uh, a new one. It's just like this. This game is horrible. It is. It is saying that the weak deserve to be punished uh, for their mental illness and all this stuff. I was like, man, this this is pretty unfortunate. Hmm. Oh. Uh. Oh. You know, it's kind of like Silent Hill. Yeah. In a way. Um. Cause like, so all these enemies, these are all like different people in the real world who were, uh, you know, they gave in to whatever type of thing, and their their baroque is their like sin, basically. I'm I'm actually gonna, I think I'm just gonna die. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You go to Baroque. No, you, you go back to town, and you. Uh... So this game is is a rare uh, one where you can actually save scum if you really want to. Uh, most games like this will delete your save when you die, but uh, this this one does let you save scum. But you I'm can not... save in the middle of combat. Yeah, but I'm not going to. It's not in the middle of combat. It's just the middle of your run. You can save uh, between floors. Uh, uh, but this is this is the kid. He's uh, I don't know his name. Bomb. Yeah, he's Opeb, I guess you can call him, because that's what I had to name him. You're, he's yourself. He is him. Uh, oh, five slices of pizza. Dang, I kind of want some pizza. <laughs> throw something at me. I might go get some later. Throw something at me. I can't throw anything at him, but this guy holds items for you between runs, I think. Starting to itch. No, that's the bank. Yeah, he's the bank. Please don't cause me any pain right now. I... Yeah, these these people all have different Baroques. Uh, so, like, his is long neck. 
He's good for nothing. Poor Oak Nick. He steals things from the dead. I feel strange. I feel like I died once before. In his poem, Sakutara Hagiwara said... So they're all in purgatory and you're over here like, Hey, it's me. Mm -hmm. uh, the bagged the bag one. Good evening. The man of this household is bedridden. Dang. Now nah, I, I can't see what's the... With the text. Oh well, I guess I'll just leave them there for now. But uh, yeah, this game. Welcome to my underground cemetery. If you die, you're all mine. If you're cool with that, please come in. God damn it. If he has another dungeon, you can I'll go be into. Waiting for you with a brand new coffin. He has like the training, yeah, training stuff, so you can go in if you want to get strong here. Splurge a little. I'll tell you. Using goddamn items is the key to survival. There's also a um, there's also a first person mode that was how the game was in the uh, original PS1 game, but uh, it's really clunky on PS2. I'm not a huge fan of it. Like the PS1 game has a better camera angle, I guess. In this one, when you're trying to look around, it's really disorienting, and you can't really see low, like this. Oh, and this map will probably tell you, like, it, it's basically just that, but thrown into 3D. Like, the way that the maps are built out and stuff. Uh, Kingdom Hearts. Hmm? Kingdom Hearts stream. Uh oh. <laughs> I don't know about Kingdom Hearts. I mean, uh, I, uh, I, I'd have to start. From, I'd have to start from the beginning. I don't. Mm. I'm not really. I'm not a Kingdom Hearts guy, man. You know this. Donald Duck. Donald. Oh yeah, I'm a big Donald Duck fan, though. I can't lie. Yeah, he's pretty funny. He's like, or whatever. I like when he's like, I'm Donald Duck. Oh. I'm Donald Duck. Oh my. The meta beings on this floor are goddamn strong. I suggest you bite an invincible bone and go straight for the pillar. The thing in the first oh, that was a fun is a recovery week. Maybe, maybe next You'll week I'll like be and vitality. So Same. You should get on, goddammit. Press the item. Press the item. Fuck the item screen. Fight on a warp If you toss it in a goddamn meta being, it'll warp somewhere else. So if you run into an enemy you don't like, toss a bone at him. Other than the individual effects of each bone, you'll recover ten health and vitality. Keep fighting if you get in trouble. But oh, I didn't know that. Alright, Eddie, let me give you this question I asked to me earlier today. What's that? Alright, so someone came up to you and they and they had the like eight pieces, like eight good pieces of like baked boneless chicken thighs, right? Mm hmm. Alright, what would you cook to accompany the chicken thighs for, for a meal? This is place to uh, heads up, so you'll recover health and vitality. Wait, what was that? Have heads and what would I eat to... No, what would you cook to go with it? The oh. If they got the chicken, like, what else would you cook to complete the, 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 the dish? Uh, I guess, like, macaroni and cheese, or, like, rice or something, I don't know. Why'd you both pick mac and cheese? <laughs> I mean, it goes pretty good with chicken. You said boneless chicken, right? Hey, boneless chicken dies. Yeah, boneless chicken's pretty easy to like. If you put it with mac and cheese, it's like an easy. No vegetables. Oh yeah, I guess that's true. No vegetables. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, they weren't my first thought. Like when you say boneless chicken, I'm like, oh hey, that that would be good. I could have a uh, get some mac and cheese. Oh, right, I should probably switch this back to third person mode. This doesn't look too great. There we go. 
Oh, I sound familiar? Mm, maybe. I don't know. I'm not sure if... Oh, I don't think I've met too, too many people. But what's important is whether you use it on yourself or throw it at the enemy. That, timing and combinations are the key. Well, it'll stick with you as you keep using items. Throw a toxic bone and you'll poison the meta being. Tossing a boom bone will cause an explosion. Hit a meta being with an invincible bone and you'll be in trouble. Find the right time and combination to make good use of the items, goddammit. Now next up is a meta being nest. I'll be frank, there are ten of them. Please use items to your goddamn advantage. You can only hold up to 20 items, so be careful. Press the map button to bring up the 2D map. The red marker displays your goddamn position and direction. We should show the enemies too. Works pretty well too, so try throwing, goddammit. Rock bones are hard, so don't fight. Here we go. Should have equipped a coat, goddammit. Oh. <laughs> I just okay. Oh, look at that something. I just blew myself up. Um. Yeah. <laughs> 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 All right. Well, I don't. I don't think I'm very clean at that. Give an item to a twisted one. Throw it at them. <laughs> there will be times you can enjoy their amusing reactions. Oh, I thought I could thought I could talk to him more. I guess not. This guy is supposed to give you a gun, but I I think I lost it when I died that last time. <laughs> and I don't have gun it anymore. Devil. Yeah, well he's he's like a gun angel. He's the one to remind you of your mission and everything. Oh, I'm dead. No, I'm not. Never mind, I'm good. That's a dope. Bones. 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 Oh. Oh, I got killed by turtle mode? Yeah, you got me. Okay, that's broke. <laughs>
I'm looking baroque. Throw something at me. Just a little bit baroque. Oh, I didn't even see this guy. No, I cannot let you pass. I've been told that it's okay to get rid of you, but I don't want to do something like that. So seriously, knock it off. Go on, get out of here. I'm telling you to go. Rage quit the game. I just got baroque done. <laughs> um. Yeah, that's 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 a uh, gaming. I think. Oh. I think I'm good. I'm gonna hop out to take a break. Uh, but thanks for watching, everybody. This was pretty fun. You gonna raid Germa? No, I'm not. I mean, how do I do that? <laughs> Is he streaming? I don't know him, but yeah, he's streaming Vampire Survivors. Oh wow! Do you think? Do you think he'll be like, "Hey, Opeb, thanks for the raid." Yeah, no, long time no see. He's like, what? Oh, Opeb, I remember when you used to carry me in Team Fortress Two, man. Yeah. Long time no see. What's the? How do you do a raid? I don't know the thing for that. Man for that. Oh no, I'm not a streamer. <laughs> Never mind. I'll just end it. <laughs> <laughs> see you guys. <laughs> Oh shit, now hit the wrong button.